today I'm uh, visiting my mom and she is my inspiration for this project. Hi everyone! Uh, today I came out to film outside because uh, here is better light, light. Inside sometimes camera can't catch me, can't focus uh, when I'm moving. So, uh, but yeah, for me it's no problem. It's like some plus 10 degrees and I have a warm wool sweater. So yeah, no problem. So, about uh, this idea to create uh, the sweater for my mom. Uh, I wanted to do it for some uh, while already and uh, I had an idea then I want to include the heart in uh, the design because I love her very much and uh, but I didn't want then this heart would be like uh, uh, stand out very much in this design but would uh, be like uh, part of some bigger like uh, design and uh, I was looking for some Latvian ornament what I could include in this design and I found one so I changed it a little bit but uh, uh, I choose to uh, have this ornament for the for the design and uh, this time <laughs> when I started to work on this idea uh, like design came out very quickly <laughs> uh, this is like end uh, design and I like it very much so uh, I decided go for this design I chose um, grey color and uh, dark red color because I knew then uh, my mom liked these colors very much and I decided to include white color so this uh, sweater wouldn't be uh, so dark it would uh, be more joyful light and uh, I knew uh, then I will make like cardigan because uh, uh, the cardigan, the style of sweater, more suits for my mother, uh, for her lifestyle and what she is wearing daily. So, uh, this is how it will look like. And I also will include uh, pockets because my mom just loves pockets. And um, uh, then I knew then I will I need to choose a very soft yarn so I choose the merino uh, also from Eastex company and uh, they had like exactly the colors uh, I was looking for and I knew then my mother also will like uh, this time a big part of the sweater I have knitted in the car uh, waiting for somebody uh, yeah it was interesting then like different, uh, like usually. Uh, one day we were visiting a dentist and in the city in which I grew up. So it uh, uh, bring me a lot of memories and uh, I like remember uh, because <laughs> one reason, because I love my mom so much because uh, she was uh, working so hard to uh, give us uh, like a positive and supportive environment where to grow up so I will be very grateful to her always and uh, I also visited our uh, Latvian capital city Riga and I spent there also some uh, hours <laughs> like one day and knit, uh, uh, knit many hours. I have filmed some moments uh, from my journey how I created this cardi cardigan so I will share with you.
I'm in uh, Sigulda today, um, in, on this hill. When I was uh, uh, going in school, I was snowboarding, so yeah, it was some 20 years ago, and then it didn't look like this. But uh, yeah, very nice place, <laughs> full of memories. <laughs> we are now in the val valley of the river, but uh, the city is located up there. Yeah, here is uh, very beautiful. Uh, you can go to the river and uh, sandy beach. While uh, Rives is visiting dentist, I will need to eat. Good morning. Uh, today I'm in the capital city of Latvia, in Riga. Uh, I need to spend some hours here, so I need to wait uh, for my mother, so I found some very quiet and green place uh, near the river Daugava. It's on a small island and uh, yeah, I will spend here some <laughs> hours and um, knit. <laughs> Maybe you see there is like uh, almost center of Riga and if I need to spend some time in the city I'm always looking for the some green spot in the map and uh, go there to spend some time yeah so this day will be different from others <laughs> So, I was knitting for some two hours, so I need a break and um, I will uh, visit the shop to buy some supplies for uh, the sweater and some other projects. Uh, usually I buy uh, things in the internet, but now when I'm in the city I also enjoy to visit the shop, yeah, so uh, I was uh, uh, working in Riga and studying for some eight years, so I know this city so for me it's easier to uh, move around with car and, uh, without using uh, some GPS so Visit, visit the shop. So, I bought some uh, fabric and um, and zippers. I can see, and then outside there is some clouds. So maybe I will need to spend some time in the car. We'll see. Yeah, maybe there will be rains for some while. But no problem, I have a big car <laughs> and I have even a mattress and a pillow and a blanket so I woke up uh, very early so in case I'm, I will be uh, tired and uh, would like to uh, take a nap <laughs> so no problem for me. Yeah, so. so nice to have a big car. <laughs>
I have finished uh, the cardigan, uh, I uh, put two pockets and I saw a uh, zipper. And uh, the edges I secured extra with uh, grey fabric. So this is how the cardigan, cardigan looks like now, when finished. So I hope you like this video. I really enjoyed this making this cardigan, this process, and uh, my mom's happy face at the end. So, and uh, the next episode will be about my sister. I will create a cardigan for her. So I can't wait to see how uh, this project will look like. So. Till next video, bye.